Hey guys, how you doing? It's Storm Miner here, bringing you a bit of what could be a weekly thing on a Friday, uh, which involves Forza Motorsport 6. Now, what a, idea that I had was the Class D car, which is like the lowest class in the in the game. What I thought would be quite a fun thing to do is to have a random number between 1 to 108, which is the amount of cars that are within that class. We put in number 1 to 108, whatever number it gives us, we pick that car from the drop down list, we then buy that car. And then what I've got to try and do is to sort of do it up, make it look cool, and then you guys, what you guys do in the comments below, is you leave a like, and then to say, comment what a rating out of 10, if I've done a good job, make it look cool, or whether I've done a crap job, we'll to try again next Friday. So we're trying to do it every Friday. So, without further ado, I think we just may as well just jump straight into it. So, here we've got just the first line of things. We've got my random generator here. If I can pop it into this screen, whether it'll work. Yep. Okay, so we've got maximum 108. And we generate. We get number 85 right down the bottom. Awesome. Right. Okay. So, a lot of counting to do. So, we'll just go to 108, then we'll count down. Hopefully, it's not. If, if, it's, if it's too expensive, then we can re roll and then try, try again. <coughs> if you obviously can't afford it. So 108, 7, 6, 5, 4, 3, 2, 1, 100, 99, 98, 97, 96, 95, 94, 93, 92, 91, 90, 89, 87, 88, 87, 86, 85. So we've got a Camaro Supersport Coupe. Not bad. That's sort of doable. So what we'll do, we'll buy this and then I'll say I can't use. Shall be a rule we can't use a display we had. See that is from Too Fast Too Furious because I think it's quite cool, but we can't copy anything. So we'll just pick colours, and then you guys just sort of sit back and then either see me fuck it up or see me create something pretty cool. Now the colour I want, the orange is pretty cool. Let's stick to the orange. Okay. So I'm trying not to spend too much money because I'll say I've got to keep races and keep the money going if it's going to be a, like a weekly series. So that'll be something quite fun to do. <coughs> this is your 1969 Chevrolet Camaro Super Sport Coupe. Mm. Now, do I just? I think I might just do aesthetics, just for the time being, and see how, how the series goes. Obviously, if we get more money, then we can look at the performance. If a good rule would be is if I get a really crap car for like a lot, like low credits, like 12,000 credits, then yeah, I can start doing it to make it ridiculously fast. So we'll just do customized car just, just now. But we'll start with the rims first. So, mm, multi piece would probably suit it, maybe. So we'll have a flick through. Black rims looks pretty badass. Well, the black rims is a. Oh my god, what are they? Oh, are they? Is it bad that I don't think they look that? I don't think they look that bad. I think they're quite cool. <coughs> I'm going to change the color, I guess. Make it black with that color. Mm, let me try something different. I don't know. I'm, I'm, I'm actually quite drawn to them. Yeah, we'll have them. I've had a lot, a lot of you are playing the comments saying, "Oh, he's fucked up already." Now, rim size. I don't think we should. Nah, I think too big a rim would ruin it. So I think we'll just do one one size up. Okay. Yeah, that doesn't look too bad. I don't think we can do much in the way of Yeah, we'll be, make us like a Camaro S sort of style. This race version. Yeah, not like that. Yeah, we'll do a kind of strip version, that'd be pretty cool. Do a lightweight version. Oh hell no, no. Stock bonnet. <coughs> Lower it. I suppose it'll help, it'll help with handling, which is something quite we kind of need. A quick upgrade now. Okay, so, aesthetic wise. Might change the paint. 
Paint your car. Yeah, okay. No, we don't want that close. <coughs> Not for me again. Yeah, I know how to do that. I, I think we could do is put like a little hash tag and then a one, so this will be the first one of the series. And then the next one we'll put a hash two on it so we can keep track of what ones we did. So, paint the body. Ooh, I like that. Yeah. I like that. Shall we paint like the bonnet the same colour as the... Nah. Maybe a bit of tint. No way, he called the window. Window tint. Oh, cool. Yeah, then you can put green tint. Yeah, why not? Let's try that. Save the current color. We'll see what sort of engine swaps we could do. I think that might be quite cool. Because if we can make it like a sort of straight line beast, then that could be at sort of 40. Upgrade shop, see what we can do. Conversions, I love this part. Engine swap, what can we put in it? So, I think it comes with a standard V8, so let's see what other ones we can get, right? Chevy Camaro 69, 5.7 litre V8, no. 7 litre V8, or a 5.9 litre V8 racing. 60 grand, fuck. Gives another 450 horsepower. How do I toggle to what's the BHP? 825 brake horsepower. Ah, uh, yeah, let's just do it. That's gonna be so cool. Oh my god, drivetrain. We need to make it four wheel drive for launch reasons. Yeah, that's fine. Just to get off the mark. Tires, make it nice and slick. Drag. Well, um, could argue this could be a drag car because it's not going to handle well, is it? Mm. No, we'll give it. We'll give it some some of them exhaust. I think we could probably do. Oh my God, you can like de-restrict it, which would then give us what nine hundred and ninety-four horsepower. Okay. Oh my God. Right, <laughs> brakes, yeah. Yeah, definitely need brakes. Weight loss, oh here we go. Yep. Take a lot of stuff out there. Right, I think this is probably worth a test drive now. It's very scary. Right, Monza, Burmese Arts. We want something really, uh, really long straight. What's the one I used to use? Um, is it a Le Mans circuit? Did it still have that? Prague, no. The streets definitely won't be good. Top Gear track? Mm. What was that Le Mans track you had it and had the other one? It had like the two mile straight on it. Hockenheim, no. Monza. Right, we'll do. We'll do like the Nurburgring. And then we'll just do like the sort of main straight. We won't do a full lap. <clears throat> That's going to be a fast monster. What I normally do is I'll, I'll turn it round and we'll slowly bring it up to the back so we can come round the bend and hit the straight full on. That oh, seems so mental. Oh. Yeah, hopefully you guys think this is quite a good idea for a series. I think it's quite cool. Oh, here we go. Right, where do we start? Right. <laughs> Just hear the bubble. Oh my god! I'm right, trying to ease it up. I don't want to ruin it. I'm 
squeeze it a bit. Oh my god! I don't know what track this is. This doesn't seem like a normal one. Though. Let's just turn around and we'll support it, right? Ready? Right, okay, ready? Three, two, one. Oh my god! Oh my god! The brakes are awful. Ah! Right, we'll do the back. We'll do it back way. Right. We'll do it in the third party. In third better mode. Right. Ready? Go. Acceleration is mental. go. It's uh, pretty phenomenal. Uh, yeah, so uh, that sort of concludes the first sort of episode of this uh, I, don't, I really thought of a name for a series. You guys think of a, of a cool series name for this. It'd be quite cool. Whether you want, it's up to you guys. We know if, if, it's, if you like the whole random generator number thing then we'll continue, continue to do that. Or whether we'll do a sort of uh, you know, most like comment below is the next car we do in the next series and then that gives me a chance to sort of save up money during the week and then we can to spend it on doing it up and then you judge whether it's a cool looking car, whether I've done a good job or been entertaining or whatever. So uh, yeah, so if you did like, please uh, smash the like button, comment down below, subscribe if you're new and my Twitch should be down below somewhere. So if I do any live sort of uh, Forza 6 racing or Destiny or whatever sort of game I'll play that, I'll, I'll, I'll play that day. Uh, yeah, so I'll see you there. Thank you very much for watching. I'll see you later.